Hello everyone, today we will resize the root partition with logical volume manager and extension of the XFS file system as well. I have highlighted six items that need to be done in this lab. In the first step we will expand the physical disk by 5 GB. In the second step we will create a file 1.txt in temp for test purposes. In the third step we will resize partition to maximum size, in my case it is DA. Next we will resize LVM, logical volume manager partition, to maximum size with common PV resize. In the fifth steps we extend the root logical volume to maximum size. And finally extend file system XFS. For this lab you need a computer or laptop with more than 4 GB of RAM as well as a virtual box or VMware workstation and an install virtual machine with the CentOS 7 operation system. Now we need to increase the physical disk by 5 GB. This is easy to do in VMware, but I would like to warn you right away. When doing an operation with a hard disk, any operation, to spawn the disk, to shrink this partition, you must make a backup. So let's expand the drive. Settings, hard disk, expand, let's add 5 gigabytes, click expand, the current disk size 20 needs to be increased by 5, to do this you need to shunt out the virtual machine. I have expanded the disk and you have to see 25 gigabytes here. OK. Let's click OK. Let's start our virtual machine. So in the TMP folder let's create a file 1.txt for the test process. File has created. Now we will resize partition to maximum size. Let's see the current partition size. Command F disk dash L. Current partition size is 26.8 gigabytes. The current size of our root partition is 18.2. It means CentOS root should be 23 gigabytes. At first, let's resize dev sda the partition with command F disk dev sda. Let's type it. F disk dev sda. Let's see current partition markup. Okay, dev sda2 Linux LVM partition. Remove disk markup for second partition. Press D and enter. D second partition. Let's see. And now for create new partition, press N. Enter. Press P as primary. Second. First sector, sector and last sector. OK. That's it. Once created with the size of partition, we need to define what type of partition we will use. Uh, for this purposes, uh, press T, second. Let's see what partition is. Linux LVM here, 8E. Press 8E, enter. And let's see system Linux LVM. Once complete with changing the type USP to print the available partition, for save your changes you have to press W and now you better reboot server.
let's type command ls blk show us block devices as you can see SDA is 24 gigabytes and SDA uh, physical disk 25 but CentOS root root file system is 17 we need to expand by 5 gigabytes it will be 22 gigabytes for this purpose now you need to resize LVM partition to maximum size type PV display to look size LVM partition Nineteen. Uh, for expanding this LVM partition, you have to resize with command PV resize. PV resize. Depth is the A2. Let's show it again. Twenty-four gigabytes. And the last step in this lab is resize logical volume and XFS file system. For LVM, this command called LV resize, but I have to show you at first current logical volume size. Command LV display. I have two logical volumes. I have to use root logical volume, and now it has 17 gigabytes. Let's expand it. Command LV extend minus L plus 100% free space and let's type what is the KR? KR tent file system with one command but you can use another command like make fs to dot xfs let's go ahead and complete this command dev centres root okay let's show us show again as you can see i have 22 gigabytes i expand this logical volume root by 5 gigabytes it is easy when you know what you do thank you for watching my video subscribe youtube channel subscribe telegram channel bye bye